I've watched this video. Oh my God, I've, Melanie. Oh my God, Melanie Martinez. Wait, what is this? What is happening? What is happening? What is happening? What is happening? Oh, snap. Wait, what? Dude, what the heck? All right. They're letting her smoke in a hospital. Oh, God. She's a cry baby. I hate babies. And that's where it begins. The birth of cry baby. Yeah, that'd be... Wait. I know her. She was from The Voice. Oh, wait. This is Melanie Martinez, isn't it? Brain with your heart. You try to... I'm actually digging this. I listen to 50 Cent, so this is a this is different. The song is good, but the video is just kind of weird. Dude, weird ass like looking stuffed animals. Dude, that was like my worst fear as a kid. That like my toys and stuff were gonna come alive. It's original though. She's creative. She's a good singer. Oh, f great. <laughs> I'm so confused. They call me cry, baby, cry, baby, okay, nobody cries that much. I love this video. It's just like her sitting in a room of tears. Oh my god. No, she's in, oh, she was drowning in her own tears because she's crying so much. We've all been there, almost drowned ourselves in our own tears. Is she like a new upcoming artist? Because I have no idea who this is. That was, I think, one of the weirdest things I've had to watch so far, like, ever in my life. If you're a big fan, like, you understand this because, like, the mom shows up in a lot of music videos and then it's the dollhouse, so, like, the water's coming out of the dollhouse, like, her dollhouse music video. Oh, it all makes sense. <laughs> Oh, this is Dollhouse, isn't it? I know that song. Dollhouse! That's why the tears were coming out of the dollhouse, because they all live in one. She's so unique. I love it. Hey, girl, open the walls. Play with your dolls. We'll be a part Okay, I've heard this song before. Mom, please. See, there's the mom again. Dad's with a slut. And your son is smoking cannabis. Oh, dang. The other song makes a little bit more sense now. Like, she's talking about, like, her broken household. B -O -L -L -H -O -U -S -E. I, I don't like it. I'm tempted to just like die half my head. I'm not gonna lie, this one's actually pretty catchy. What are you seeing that no one's seeing? The girl is eight. What is she doing? She trapped the little girl. Hey girl, open your walls, play with your dog. Perfect family. Oh no! What? Zero to hundred real quick. What are they gonna do? I'm, I'm digging this one a little bit more than the other one. This one's kind of cool. What's gonna happen? Wait, is she like turning more and more doll like? Yeah. Smile for the picture. Pose with your father. Won't you be a good sister? I see things that nobody else I don't like the necklace. I love it. I love it. So cool. Like, I was literally just listening to her music, like, on the way up here, because I love her so much. Okay, so are you familiar with the artist from these videos? No. Is her name Melanie? That was Melanie Martinez. I'm a fan, <laughs> huge fan. Oh my God, her music's so good. It's Melanie Martinez. Obviously, I'm in love with her. This is the singer Melanie Martinez. I've heard of her. What do you think of her music videos? Uh, it, it, it's, it's a bit different than what I'm used to seeing. I've seen a lot of crazy music videos and I guess this will probably be like, Top 20. The videos are so weird and they take away from the actual music because you're too busy looking at the video. It's creepy but cute at the same time, which I think brings a lot of appeal. The majority of her songs just sound really creepy and they kind of get to you. They're very like childish themed with a weird demonic undertone. The first video we showed you got over 10 million views in a little over a month 
and the second one is her most popular so far that has over 37 million views. That's crazy though, but I mean, I can see why. It's such like a interesting video. You just kind of want to watch and be like, yo dude, come here, just watch this video. Melanie has a very dedicated fan base and they've been clamoring for this episode of Teens React for a while. We're here. Why do you think she's gotten to be so popular? Honestly, I don't see why she's so great. I can't go from gangster rap to Melanie Martinez. Because of the diversity of her music videos. Like, so they're so strange and so weird and like, like people get attracted to those things. Her voice itself is just not something that people hear every day. I saw people at her concert from different age groups, from different, like I saw boys, girls, and you could see like, different people coming together because the lyrics are, like help everybody so much. So Melanie got her start as a contestant on the show, The Voice. Oh, really? Usually when I think of shows like that, I think of like just complete pop. I don't see her as that type of person. With those type of singing shows, I just kind of imagine like factory built like pop stars. It's kind of strange just because like when you watch shows like The Voice and American Idol and X Factor, you never really see the losing contestants get a career afterwards but her career is just completely skyrocketed. Her first album is a concept album that follows the story of a character she created inspired by her childhood nickname, Crybaby. Oh, see? Mind blown. What do you think about this as a concept for an album? I mean, Marshall Mathers, Slim Shady, that's all I gotta say. It's cool because your stories are, are a lot better than just singing about like money and stuff. It's really cool that she's actually decided to do that. It shows that she's like really true to herself that she's actually like stuck to what she thought as a little kid. For her to bring that back and, you know, even accept it and put it out there is like, yeah, they call me a crybaby, but look at me now. I just have to like shrug it off like. <sighs> her character comes from her being so sensitive and emotional and dealing with anxiety and fear as a teenager. As a teen yourself, is that something you relate to? Well, yeah, I think everyone can relate to it. Everyone goes through feelings of like anxiety and stress. We have the stress level of like 40 year old people at our age because of the amount of like academic stress that is put upon us. Having a social life and then wanting to feel like you're accepted or you fit in because that's really important in high school. You have so much pressure on you and I can see like it's okay being sensitive and it's okay to cry because everyone feels it which is why her music is so popular. She is known for being very hands on on all aspects of her career. She writes her own music, she designs the album art and even directs some of her videos. I, I just think it's crazy. I applaud her for, for that because a lot of artists just have people they hire do it for them. She has a vision. She's She has a message she wants to give to the world if she's doing all this. Um, I admire when people take the initiative to do something themselves and they don't let anybody else touch their art. Even when you watch the behind the scenes of her music videos, like you see her behind the camera and like very much just kind of like directing it and showing things how she wants it. She has this exact vision in her mind. Finally, now that you've heard some of her music here, do you think that you're gonna check out more Melanie Martinez? No. I'm sorry. This is not my music. I don't really think so. It's just a very different genre that I'm not a big fan of. Probably. I mean, if, if she makes more good music, I'll listen to it. Yeah, and I'm actually gonna pay attention to the lyrics this time, not just watch the creepy videos. That's not even a question. I'll be listening to her every day. Can't wait for the next album. Yes, I will probably listen to the album for the millionth time again. <laughs> oh, totally. She's getting a lot of attention because it is her. It's her as a person, her as an artist, directing, it's her brain, it's her concept, and it's like only she can really achieve what she has in her head of what she wants it to be like, and so she's doing it herself. Thanks for watching this episode of Teens React. We'll be back soon, so don't be a crybaby, hit subscribe. A bunch of the reactors have their own YouTube channels, so click the button below to check them out. Thanks for watching, and remember, don't trust your dolls. Apparently they're really creepy.